Hello there, you're watching Dansky, the place to be to develop your creative skills and grow as a designer. In this tutorial, we're going to learn how to quickly export assets in Adobe Illustrator. So as you can see, I've got my artwork on screen and I want to export all of the individual elements within this artwork individually so that they can be used on the web. So one way that you used to be able to do this was to go up to File, down to Export and Save for Web. And you could specify your format at the top and lots of different options and then click Save. However, there is now a new and much easier way to do this. You can go up to File, down to Export and select Export for Screens. And it brings up this page and you can select Asset Export Panel. And if you go to Window, you can see that if you don't see this screen, you can select it here. Now what this allows you to do is individually drag elements within this panel and it will start to list them all out. So if we click one of our numbers at the moment, this is editable text, we can see that our bounding box is a lot higher than the number itself. So we want to convert that to an image first. So let's go to type and create outlines. So now when we select this, the bounding box matches the height and width of the number. And now we can just left click and drag this into our asset panel. And it will list that as asset one. We can just double click on the text there and we'll change that to four and press enter. Now we're going to do the same with the background. Just drag this big block of yellow and we'll just call that BG for background. We don't need to drag the other number and I've got this face here. So if I just drag that out, you can see that this is what the face looks like. These shapes are all grouped together, which is great because we don't need those to be ungrouped. So we can just drag this as one shape into the asset panel and I can call that emoji. So these are the three elements that make up the design. So it may be an app with lots of icons or a website that you've designed and you want to export all of the individual elements without having to do it manually. So now we can specify a few options here and you can click this little icon at the bottom and it will load this in a larger screen. So you can select which assets you'd like to export and which artboards as well. So we'll keep it on the asset tab and we're going to select all assets. So they're all selected here. You can pick a folder where it will export the assets to. You can select iOS or Android or you get a few additional format options here. So I'm going to select iOS just for this tutorial. And then you can specify the size. So if you're exporting an app, for example, you can select times one you can select whether it's PNG, JPEG or SVG. So let's add another scale. We'll add times two. We'll add another one at the bottom times three. So it's going to export each of these three objects three times each. So there'll be three number fours times one, one at times two and one at times three, three backgrounds and three emojis all at the relevant sizes in the right formats. Let's just add in the suffix here. So the suffix is what will appear at the end of your file name. And at the bottom, you can specify a prefix. So you can see here that I've got the prefix of project. So when I export these files, the file names will be project underscore, for example, emoji. And then it will end with at one, at two and at three. So once you've specified all your settings, you can go ahead and click export asset. It will also tell you the total number of assets that will be exported. And then here we have the folder. So we've got the number four at times one, times two and times three size. And the same again for the background and the same again for the emoji as well. And there we go. That's how we can quickly export assets in Adobe Illustrator. As always guys, please feel free to leave any questions or comments below. Like this video if you enjoyed it. Take care and I'll see you next time.